An electric semi-truck catches fire inside a facility. A lithium-ion battery getting the blame tonight. Crews on scene for hours near Kyrene and Elliott. And that's where we find our Ashley Paredes. Ashley, this was no easy task putting this fire out. Not at all. There was one thing, but then bringing the truck outside was also a long process. It was a joint effort with fire receiving help from multiple other agencies. And if you take a look right behind me, you can see crews still there, but calling what happened here at Arizona Lithium a hazardous situation. Crews on scene found a Nikola semi truck inside of the building with one of its lithium ion cell batteries on fire. We're told flames were contained to only that truck as firefighters continued putting water on the cell to keep it cool. We have video showing the truck being brought outside as a precaution. Tempe Fire says the purpose of that is to separate the cell and have it stored away from the truck. No injuries have been reported. And while investigators work to figure out what started the fire here in Tempe, it comes about three months after a row of Nikola trucks caught fire at the company's Phoenix headquarters. You may remember this video. An investigation later found that a coolant leak in a battery pack is what sparked the fire. The company then recalled hundreds of its battery electric trucks. As for tonight, tonight's situation, we are still trying to figure out the connection between Arizona Lithium and um, the situation that happened here with Nikola. It's still unsure. We did try to contact this facility. But we have not heard back just yet. Live in Tempe, I'm Ashley Perret, ABC 15 Arizona. Ashley, thank you.